cervicogenic dizziness, causes and remedies. Suffering from cervicogenic dizziness is without a doubt an ailment as uncomfortable as it is paralyzing, something that can slow down our daily life, keep us from working, or affect our normal responsibilities. Dingling, chills, a feeling of cold, tension at the nape of the neck, dizziness, etc. Are the most common symptoms in which, unfortunately, in many cases become chronic. The vertebrae that we normally call the cervical vertebrae, whose function is to maintain our heads upright, are made up of seven pieces where stress commonly concentrates, where poor posture, fatigue or anxiety can lead to those problems inevitably associated with terrible dizziness. Causes of Cervicogenic Dizziness Neurovascular compression due to degenerative changes in the vertebrae, producing an inevitable rigidity. Conflicts between the information of the movement of the neck and the information of the inner ear and vision, which produces a decompensation where we feel a continual instability, as if we were all of a sudden in a moving vehicle. The eyes note movement, but the liquid in the inner ear and the atlas and axis vertebrae remain rigid, and do not adjust, resulting in an imbalance and resulting dizziness. All of that makes us lose confidence when the time comes to do many activities in our daily life. We feel a compression and a hypervigilance. We refuse to even move our neck when we feel a little better due to fear, something that can, in turn, continue causing more dizziness. Remedies for Cervicogenic Dizziness Recommended Treatments Hot Cold Treatment we will begin by applying a bag of ice for 3 or 4 minutes, followed by hot showers, hot compresses, or hot water bags. Note that it is not recommended for the skin to have a heating pad on it during the night. As much as possible, we will avoid intense physical activity. We must avoid inflaming the cervicogenic area further. Rosemary or lavender water baths are very beneficial, as they act as anti-inflammatories and are very useful in treating muscle spasms, lower back pain, cervical pain, etc. We will attempt to keep a regular sleep cycle, thereby contributing to the stability of the body, and also reducing stress levels. Physical therapy is also very beneficial, as is doing aerobic exercises to help our body and nervous systems the mobility and dynamics necessary to return to wellness. It is also necessary to soften the rigidity in the neck the greater the rigidity and the less mobility, the more imbalance between the sight and inner ear, basic factors in causing a terrible dizziness. Plans to remedy vertigo. Ginkgo biloba, its extract helps our circulation at a cerebral level, resolving dizziness, vertigo, ringing in the ears, headaches, etc. We can drink infusions or take in supplement forms sold by drugstores or health food stores. Ginger, its properties are perfect to remedy dizziness and eliminate the feeling of nausea. We can take it as an infusion in the mornings. Passionflower, it helps us prevent dizziness, and it is also perfect for situations of stress or anxiety that are basically a part of the triggers for cervicogenic pain. 
we can take as an infusion two or three times a day. Red wine, it is commonly used to improve cerebral circulation, also helping those suffering from dizziness, vertigo, nausea, and migraines. The juice of the grapes is just as helpful as the leaves of the red grape, which is drunk as an infusion when the leaves are dried. We boil them in water, let it sit, and drink a little at a time throughout the day. Chamomile and mint infusions, they have the same properties as ginger, alleviating nausea, vomiting, and regulating the feeling of dizziness. We can drink them as often as we need them. Vitamin B6, there are many studies that support its importance in resolving dizziness and vertigo. Pyrodoxine improves the metabolization of enzymes and amino acids related to mood, energy, muscle performance, and body balance. All that it does is indispensable for maintaining and improving the health of our bones and our vertebrae, for regulating the feeling of anxiety, instability, and vomiting. We can find it in capsules from an herbalist or from a natural food store, and it is recommended to take 1.3 mg daily for adults, and 0.6 mg daily for children of 8 to 13 years. We can also find it in foods with whole grains, bananas, potatoes, garlic, chestnuts, prunes, pistachios, sole, cauliflower, spinach, etc.